Aha, so take a look over here. This is an Object Connex 500 multi-material 3D printer and it's printing a very nice iPhone cover for us right here as you can see the print head moving backwards and forwards uh, we're jetting 16 microns uh, in this case it's actually 30 microns because we're using it in multi-material mode uh, and as you can see the UV light follows the print head backwards and forwards and cures the material hardening it uh, before the next layer is applied so what we actually see here are three unique aspects of 3D printing one is that we're building an iPhone cover, a customized iPhone cover from nothing, literally from the ground up, uh, which is a very unique uh, phenomena in the production world. Normally you'd require a production line to produce something like this and it would churn out many hundreds, many thousands uh, at the very least to make it uh, efficient. And here we're producing a one-off, um, usually for prototyping purposes, but also for rapid manufacturing purposes. A second interesting aspect here of 3D printing and unique to 3D printing is that we can see there's a number of gear wheels that are on the back cover of the iPhone cover um, and when this is washed um, you'll find that the gear wheels will be able to move against each other um, and they are seamlessly connected to the iPhone cover and normally in the production process these gear wheels would need to be assembled um, usually by machine very occasionally by hand to the iPhone cover for them to work. So another unique aspect of 3D printing is complex assemblies built from the ground up. A third unique aspect of 3D printing and really particularly unique to the Object Connect system here is that you have two different materials being printed at the same time. The uh, iPhone base is what looks like to me um, a clear transparent material. You can't really tell because there's support material underneath it. Um, and on top you have the object rigid black material. So we're printing two distinct materials with distinct material properties at the same time in the same prototype. Something that is unique to the Object Connect system. Um, next we're going to see a whole range of these that have all come out of the printer um, which will show different combinations of colors and material properties and transparencies. So let's go have a look at that right now. Okay, so here we are back in the office. And I've got for us uh, a nice iPhone. Um, and here we have a very nice 3D printed iPhone cover. Let's just make sure it works. There we go. It's on. The material is strong enough uh, to snap fit onto the iPhone very nicely and not to, and not to break. Um, as you can see, this particular iPhone cover has been printed in the object rigid white material uh, in combination with the rigid black material. Um, and what's really unique about the object Connex multi-material 3D printing system is that as well as the white and the black materials that can be printed at the same time, you can also mix them together to produce these grey shades. Okay, so that's one. And as you can see the interacting uh, gear wheels work very nicely, very smoothly. Uh, so that's one cover. Here's another cover that I produced. This time it's the reverse, pretty much the reverse. You've got white gear wheels, you've got a grey surround, um, and as you can see, that one also works very nicely. Third cover here. This one is actually 3D printed in object clear transparent material in combination with the uh, rigid black. I think this is the one we actually saw being 3D printed on the Object Connex 500 machine that we just visited. And of course, what's also very interesting about the object system is that you're not just limited to single shades, single grades. You can even create patterns. In this case, we've got polka dot. We have the clear transparent material with black dots inside, which is very nice. And of course, here's another example with a very nice grid. 3D printed in a single piece with all the parts interconnecting and working together very nicely. So there you go, a number of examples of iPhone covers all 3D printed on the Object Connex multi-material 3D printer 
using a range of materials the clear transparent material, the rigid black material, the rigid white material and various digital material combinations which produce the grey and blue effects that we've seen here. Thank you very much. Have a good day.